Welcome back, Legendary Potato here, and today I'm going to be going through the top 5 forgotten features that were once in Minecraft. These are all features that were in Minecraft and got removed and forgotten about by pretty much most players of Minecraft. And so I'm going to be talking about those in today's video, so hopefully you guys will enjoy the video. Of course, if you do, make sure you do leave a like on all that sort of great stuff. But these features are all really cool, so make sure you do stick around to the end, because they're all really neat, of course, and it kind of teaches you a little bit about Minecraft's history. So with that said, let's get right into the first one here. So I bet you're probably not going to believe some of these once existed in the game, uh, but let's start off with the first one, which is actually probably one of the crazier ones, uh, is skis. That's right, skis, the things you use to like go down mountains, snowy mountains, and, and you can ski down them. Uh, they were once in Minecraft. I know this sounds crazy, like what? Is he making stuff up? I'm not making stuff up. Skis were in Minecraft for a very short amount of time. So they were added in 1.4.6. I'm gonna put some uh, pictures on the screen or a picture of the, what the skis looked like. There was this texture of skis that were added by Dinnerbone. And so he added the skis. They were later removed in 1.6, but it was kind of strange that they once existed in the game. There were skis. What was the plan for that? Uh, but it was labeled as being a red herring and there was really no mention of them since. So that's a little bit strange to me. Skis once existed in Minecraft. Doesn't that sound a little bit strange? Doesn't doesn't that seem like that's something that was like a good idea, but then also like not a good idea? I don't even know. Would skis in Minecraft be cool? Uh, personally, maybe. I guess they could be a cool feature. Of course, they're probably not going to come to Minecraft, but it would be cool if they did exist somehow. But um, those were the skis. Skis existed in Minecraft for a very short amount of time. Removed. Never mentioned again. Kind of a little bit strange. But let's of course move on to the next one here. So this next one is going to be Crying Obsidian. So way, 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 way back in the day of old days of Minecraft, uh, there were no beds. What you had to use instead was Crying Obsidian. So this block is a really strange thing. Like it, it's basically, it's obsidian. It looks like obsidian. The texture is a little bit different. And of course, there's also blue streaks, which I guess uh, makes the name Crying Obsidian make a little bit of sense. But what this block was is it was used to set your spawn. You would do something with the creating of, or you, the crying of city. You would do something with that. You create it, uh, and it would set your spawn. So instead of beds, uh, this is the thing you would use. And you weren't even able to sleep back then. There were no beds to sleep through uh, through the night. So um, of course that was kind of a thing as well. You had to sit through the night. Um, that's the thing. So very old back in the days of Minecraft, you used this weird crying obsidian block, and it's kind of strange. Uh, it really didn't suit the modern day Minecraft, of course. So it kind of made sense uh, that this thing was removed at some point because imagine having to use this weird block to set your spawn that wouldn't really make too much sense i really do like the whole bed concept that was a really good idea from minecraft of course but yeah that was crying obsidian it was way back in the early days of minecraft way forgotten about uh, and most people probably don't even remember or never heard of it before so that's why i think it's an interesting one to bring up of course that's crying obsidian and well let's keep moving on of course so this next one here is going to be the quiver and the quiver actually has a really cool history which i'll get into in just a little bit here uh but the quiver uh the idea of course was there's like this texture and there's like this whole idea where they're going to use the quivers for arrows for some reason uh, so they were going to add that and you'd be able to use your arrows in the quiver like how quivers work uh, so they had the idea for this uh, but then it never actually turned into anything uh, which is a little bit unfortunate. It would have been really cool to have a quiver and maybe you could have done something with that, had some arrows and, you know, put them in there. And so I feel like this would have been cool. It would have been in your inventory, kind of like how armor works, kind of like how the uh, new Elytra works. Or I guess it's not really new anymore. <laughs> Elytra is pretty old at this point. Um, but basically it would have your own inventory spot where you would put the quiver in. You could store your arrows in there, which I thought was really neat. But they decided to remove this feature and never really got added into Minecraft officially, uh, which is a little bit unfortunate. It would have been really cool to have a quiver in the game, uh, but for whatever reason they decided not to add the quiver in. Um, that's their decision, of course, as well. But the thing is about the quiver is that they actually considered making the quiver again in the 1.9 update. So they considered doing the quiver, uh, but then they kind of decided not to do it. They tried it again, didn't really work out very well, so they actually scrapped that idea for a second time. So that's pretty crazy. The quiver was actually tried for twice, uh, but it actually didn't get through. So whatever reason it is, they don't seem to uh, get the quiver to work or they don't get it in a way that they want to do it. So that's a little bit sad there. Hopefully maybe in the future we'll see the quiver because this is actually a feature that I feel like would be really great for the game as well to have this sort of item and to be able to store your arrows more compact, I think would make the survival experience a lot more fun. 
It's a new item that you can find or craft. And I think it's something that they should totally add to Minecraft. Of course, let me know what you guys think of these down in the comments. But Quiver, it's something that was added twice. Didn't get very far, so let's keep moving on here. So we'll go to this next one here, which this one's a really strange one. I don't understand what the point of this one was, uh, but it's the Brick Pyramid. So you'll see some gameplay on the screen, but the brick pyramid, essentially what it is, is a pyramid made out of bricks. Pretty crazy. Wow, that's how the, it got the name, right? Wow, crazy stuff. Uh, but this is something added very early on in the days of Minecraft, and what it was was uh, something added by Notch, where it's like this custom structure where it's literally just a pyramid, and that's all there is to it. It's made out of the bricks, and these things were huge. The biggest structure, even bigger than the Woodland Mansion, these things were enormous, but of course they were removed and really serve to no purpose. You go to these pyramids, they have nothing but bricks. There's nothing inside them. They're completely full, not even hollow, but full completely of bricks. So there's no reason to go inside these things. There's no reason to break the bricks, unless you, I guess you want bricks, then you could take the bricks, I guess. But these things were just really bad. They would no reason to have these in your world at all. They were just these big space sucks and just, it was just not great. So they just kind of sucked up all the space in your world. Isn't that just sad and dumb and what, why did it even exist? I didn't even understand this. Why did the brick pyramid even exist? But I don't know, that's something Notch made back when he was working on Minecraft. Obviously, he doesn't work on Minecraft anymore since 2014. So, I don't know, some of the weird ideas I guess he had, he was kind of experimenting with the game, and uh, one of the brick pyramid things was the thing that he came up with. So, um, that's the thing there. Obviously, it's not in the game anymore. You've probably never seen a brick pyramid before, and if you have, then uh, you probably built that yourself, and you probably forgot or something, or your friend built a weird brick pyramid. I don't even know, but obviously it doesn't exist, and this is a good feature that doesn't exist. I'm glad this one doesn't exist. This one would be really dumb. Uh, there's no reason to have this and any sort of reason. So, that said, let's move on to the very last one here, which is going to be the studded armor. So, uh, there are basically several sprites, uh, sprites? Yeah, <laughs> sprites, I messed up the word there. They were added in, uh, in dev, uh, point three one. Yeah, and so it was in this items.png, uh, they were taken from Notch's unfinished game, uh, from Legend of the Chambered, and so, these are things, these are sprites here, so let's go ahead and take a look at these sprites, uh, and there's also a couple other sprites as well, but we're gonna pay attention to the studded armor. So you look at the studded armor and it actually looks very similar to the old leather armor texture, but as well as that, it also looks like it's in combination uh, with the chainmail armor. So it looks like they kind of mash together the chainmail along with the leather and it gives you this really weird looking armor, which actually kind of looks nice as well. Uh, but it was eventually removed, of course, uh, for whatever reason they decided to remove this and now we have chainmail armor, we have leather armor, they're two completely separate things. Uh, but started armor was a thing that was added very early on in the very very early days of Minecraft. We're talking like super duper way before beta and it's so early on that honestly like these things were probably forgotten about for obvious reasons. That's the started armor. It looked pretty cool. Uh, I guess we'll never get to know how good this armor would have been in comparison to leather or to chainmail. If uh, I mean obviously chainmail was added way after that uh, but and we never got to see how strong it could have been in comparison to modern day Minecraft stuff, um, which is a little bit sad. Maybe it would have been a good armor. Maybe it would have been pointless. Not exactly too sure about that, but that's the studded armor. And well, it was completely forgotten about like the rest of these features. So that was all these forgotten features in today's video. Hope you guys did enjoy it, of course. Let me know which one is your favorite or your least favorite down in the comment section below. Or if there's any other ones that you feel like that I missed out on that you thought were really neat as well, you can go ahead and let me know down in the comment section below. Uh, but I thought these were all really cool. It was kind of neat to see uh, what sort of things were added in Minecraft at one point and then just completely removed and never really mentioned. Like, a lot of these things were never mentioned past that. I mean, the quiver is kind of the exception to that. The quiver was mentioned. Uh, but other than that, these things have been just completely forgotten about in Minecraft's history. But, of course, you can uh, find them up through the Minecraft wiki and all these other uh, sources as well to find that these are actually real. So, you can go ahead and look them up. If you don't believe me, if you think I'm a lunatic who's making stuff up, Go look them up for yourself. I'm not making these things up. They're real. So, yeah. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. Of course, if you did, make sure you do leave a like on it. And subscribe if you're new to the channel. Let me know down in the comments section what you guys thought of this video. And I'll see you guys in the next video. So, have a good one, guys. And I'll see you guys next time. So, have a good one, guys. Peace out.